that. Hello everyone, I'm Chris Erickley and welcome to your Tuesday edition of the PE Crime Blotter. Federal officials have proposed lowering the legal drinking level from 0.08 to 0.05. I'm joined now by Press Enterprises' Brian Rokos. Brian, uh, what has the reaction been to this proposal? Well, the National Transportation Safety Board uh, is trying to reduce uh, drunk driving uh, fatalities, drunk driving accidents, like a lot of agencies are, and it's come up with this proposal for uh, the blood alcohol level. Uh, the, re the reaction is not one of support for this. Uh, federal agencies, National Highway Transportation Safety Administration has not endorsed it. Mothers Against Driving, uh, Drunk Driving has not uh, endorsed it. Uh, and, you know, you're certainly going to have opposition from you know, someone who likes to have a glass of wine with dinner or uh, certainly the alcohol uh, industry. Uh, from my research, uh, people are saying that uh, a 120-pound woman who has one drink or a 160-pound man who has two drinks would exceed uh, the legal uh, limit of uh, 0.05 uh, blood alcohol level. And, and, you know, you go out to dinner and, you, you know, you, you think you're drinking responsibly and, and now you're risking being, you know, Put in handcuffs. And what would need to be done to get this passed, and what exactly is the likelihood, given all the negative support? Well, it, it would rely on the states, each of the individual states, to pass uh, a law like that. Each of the 50 states right now, the level of presumed intoxication is 0 .08. Uh, so you would have opposition from you know the general public and certainly uh, the restaurant. Uh, industry. I mean, you go into any restaurant, they, they're, you know, the first thing they do is they push a margarita or a mixed drink uh, on you, and uh, certainly they would uh, oppose it. I mean, I just, you know, there, there are a lot of great ideas out there, but this is one that, that doesn't look like initially that there's any sort of ground groundswell of uh, support. Hi, right, Brian. Thanks for joining us. That does it for your Tuesday edition of the PE Crime Blotter. Be sure to join us right here on PE.com for the latest on this story.